Welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Shauna, Shauna the MUA, and I'm back with another video. Um, as you've probably seen in my first video, I did a um, video on the Makeup by Mario collab or collection with his skin products, bronzers, and blushes. Now I'm going to actually do a review on the Makeup by Ariel with Morphe collab. I did take the brushes out. I'm going to use a few of the brushes doing a eye look. I'm using the P. Louise Rumor 2. His A11 brush. And I am using the Juvia's Place, uh, the Bronze Rustic Palette. This is a very summery palette, so I'm just going to put that yellow shade um, into my crease. And his brushes are so soft. It's so soft. They don't feel like they're poking you, no nothing. Like, his brushes are definitely... This one's kind of big, but um, we're going to make it work. So let me see if I need to zoom you guys in. So I'm just blending that yellow tone. Into my crease. Next I'm going to use his A uh, A25 brush, which is this. And I'm going to mix these two, so I'm not going to pick them back up. I'm mixing those two. That tan one, that tan color actually comes out more orange. So as you can see, it's coming out. Back you guys up a little again. Which today is so it doesn't really matter. So I'm just putting that in my crease. Then I'm going to put a little bit of that deeper tone. And I'm going to blend that out. I actually really like his brushes. They're extra soft. Like, extra soft. And they're blending perfect. So next, I'm going to use, this is from the Makeup Revolution palette. I'm going to use this deeper brown. And I'm going to put that on the outer part of my eye just to kind of deepen it up a little. Again, I'm blending out any harsh lines. And then next, I am going to take... Which brush did I use? Alright, so next I'm going to take his A29 brush. It's just like a regular eyeshadow brush. And I'm going to take the bronze uh, shade here. And because it's not exactly, I don't really have a light um, shade in this palette, I am going to mix it with the lighter shade in the Makeup Revolution palette because I don't really want this extra golden shade. So I'm just going to spray my brush with, um, I'm just going to spray my brush with uh, Fix Plus, and I'm going to take the lighter shade and the Makeup Revolution palette. And then I'm just going to blend that out. I'm going to use, I'm trying to use all the brushes, so A20, I'm just going to go in here and kind of blend that part out, I'm going to add a little bit on this side. Alright, 
So now that we have that down, I am going to prep and get my lashes ready. Get some glue. I'm going to use his um, eyeliner brush, which is A16. And I'm going to use my Inglot. I really like his angle brush. It has like an indent in there that really kind of just hugs your, um, kind of hugs your water, your lash line. My line is a little jacked up, but it's okay. I'm rushing. Um, and I'm using the Too Black Matte Cosmetics Discontinued. This one. This is like my favorite mascara. And they only have the waterproof left. So then I'm just going to line the bottom of my um, eye with this liner. This is a Morphe liner. Um, their Morphe uh, black liner. Next, I'm going to smudge the bottom. So I'm going to go back with that deeper shade from the Makeup Revolution. And I'm just going to smoke out the bottom of my lash line. Sorry guys, um, my camera shut off. So you already know about to put on my SLR Beauty lashes. So I'm going to put on my lashes and be right back. Finished up my makeup. Um, I finished up my makeup. I went ahead and added my flirty lashes. If you guys would like to buy some, go ahead and click on my website. I linked it down below, um, slrbeauty.com. Um, and then I just finished off my look with the KKW Lip Liner Nude 2.5 and Quickie Lipstick from um, ColourPop. And then also Be A 10 Cosmetics. I use their gloss and Be Relentless. Um, and yeah, this is my final look. So my final thoughts on these brushes are, they're amazing guys. Um... They're extra soft, like they're the bristles, even though they're synthetic, they're still soft. Um, it blends like a dream. Like I really like, I really like this A25 brush. The eyeshadow brush was also pretty good. The A29, the liner brush, I definitely love um, as well. I didn't get to use some of the other brushes, like three of the other brushes, but you guys, it's worth the money. Sorry to say, but it's worth the money. So, if you haven't already, um, if you haven't already bought um, the eye kit, he does have a face kit as well. Um, I didn't buy that one because I didn't get a discount. <laughs> um, but I didn't buy that one. I only got the eye set. I might just go back and get another eye set because I need one for my kit and for myself. And then um, maybe I'll try out the face uh, kit as well. But definitely, I think that the set is worth it. Go ahead and spend those coins. I believe it's like $40 or 30 something for the kit, um, the eye brush set. So definitely check out Morphe and the Makeup Ariel uh, collab. They're definitely worth it. I can't stress that enough. They're very soft. Like, sometimes you don't get brushes that are that soft and actually function right. So, it's amazing that, you know, he came out with this collab. You know, when makeup artists always collab with a brand, the products are usually pretty good. So, 
go ahead and spend those coins guys so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this review um give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and see you guys next time